In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the issue where your Windows Media Player is not working. So whether you're getting some kind of error message or it's just not working in general, then what you need to do to fix this is head over to your start menu and search for settings and then click on the settings window. Using the search box in the top left hand side, you need to type in optional features and in this drop down, just select optional features. Then if you scroll down to the added features, we need to locate the Windows Media Player. So my one is the Windows Media Player Legacy app, but you may just have the original Windows Media Player. Either of them is fine. And what we're going to do is just click on the drop down next to it and select remove. So now if you scroll all the way to the top, you can see this application has been removed and it does require a system restart. Before we restart our computer though, what we're going to do is click on the view features button and then we're just going to search for Windows Media Player. Make sure you have the box checked like this and press next and then click on add. And that's going to go ahead and reinstall the Windows Media Player to your computer. So once the app's finished installing, you'll then need to restart your computer for these changes to take effect. And it's as simple as that, guys. That's how you fix your Windows Media Player on your computer. If you did find this video helpful, then let me know in the comments and I'll see you in the next one.